intrepid explorers. I'm so excited that you could join us today because we have got an enormous treat in store for you. I'm just on my way to pick up Cammy, and then we'll be on our way. Ah, and here she is now. Good morning, Captain Cuthbert. Good gravy, Cammy. What is that enormous bag? Oh, this? It, it's my trunk. Your trunk? You know, my suitcase. Yes, I know what a trunk is, Cammy, but why have you got one with you? Well, you said we were going to need a big trunk, so I brought one. Not need a big trunk, Cammy. See a big trunk. We're going to see a big trunk today. What do you mean? You'll see. Come on, let's pull over. Look through my magical binoculars. And remember, everyone, take a deep breath before we go. <gasps> One, two, two, three! Cuthbert. Today we are in India. In India? And there's so much to see in India. Oh, but I haven't got my trunk with me. You're not going to need it, Cammy. There are lots of different types of trunks to see here. Oh, yes! Look at that trunk on this elephant. Oh, and look! The elephant is eating! <laughs> yes, Cammy. They're picking up food with their trunk and putting it into their mouth. This one is flapping his ears all around before putting his trunk over his head. Ah, yes. That's a good trick for flicking water on their backs, too. Now listen, can you hear that? Oh yes, it's the orchestra. There they are, along with our... Conductor! Excellent memory, Cammy, just like an elephant's. And what else do you see? Oh, it's all the animals coming to listen again. The kangaroos. The fish. The swans on the water. Our dear friends, the lions, next to their piano. And our hens and roosters, let's not forget. And a cuckoo with the clarinet. Who have we forgotten, though? <laughs> I'd have thought it was obvious, Cammy. Our enormous elephant. And look, he's waving his trunk around in time to the music. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Why are you counting numbers, Captain Cuthbert? I'm counting in time to the music, Cammy. Can you do it with me? One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, I like this game. What does it mean? This piece of music is called a waltz, and the elephant is waltzing along to the music. Oh, I wish I had a big trunk like that, so I could sway it in time to the music too. All in good time, Cammy, all in good time. First, we need to take a closer look at one of our instruments. the double bass. Coincidentally, the biggest instrument in the orchestra. Wow! The double bass sounds so low and heavy. <laughs> Just like... Oh, an elephant! I'd 
like to know more about the double base. Come on then, Cammy. Let's have a peek through my binoculars and see who we can find to help us. Music, 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 Mike. Get out. Music, 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 Mike. Strike. Music, 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 Mike. Music, 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 Mike. Music, 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 Mike. Yeah. Hello, Music Mike. But where is he? I think he's hiding behind his house. Oh, phew! It's just you guys. You scared me. Why are you hiding, Music Mike? There was this enormous elephant dancing about, and every time he took a step, the ground was shaking under me feet because he was humongous! Oh, I'm sorry about that, Music Mike. That would be our fault. We've been listening to the double bass and the elephant has been swaying his trunk in time to the music. Ah, well, that makes sense. We were wondering if you could tell us something about the double bass, as a matter of fact. Righto, let's check it out. Whoa! The double bass is the deepest and the largest instrument in the orchestra. It's part of the string family, like the violin, viola and the cello, but it's the big one. If you include the neck and the funny pin sticking out of the bottom, it's a full six feet tall. That's tall for me, and I'm average height. a sound, you get a bow and you roll it over the strings, or you can pluck the strings with your fingers. It's like an elephant because when you play those deep notes, it gives the effect of being a slow beast of the wild, taking big steps even when dancing. you got to love the double bass. It's a beauty. Well, see you later, Captain. See you later, Cammy. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goo music, 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 Mike, yeah. Those elephants were enormous. Uh, aren't they amazing? Did you know that they are the largest existing land animal and that they can live to be over 70 years old? That is old. And they can dance too. Ah, yes. Now, can you remember the name of the dance that goes one, two, three, one, two, three? That's called the waltz. Can you dance the waltz, Cammy? Of course, Captain Cuthbert. All red pandas know how to dance the waltz. Oh, that's fantastic. Well, perhaps you can teach it to all our fellow adventurers at home. OK, everybody, make sure you have lots of space round about you so you can shake your arms and take some enormous elephant steps. First, we need to listen very carefully and count the beats of the music. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Now step to the side. with enormous elephant steps. Going round in a circle. Swishing our trunks in the water. And now in the trees. It's so hot. Time to flick some water on our backs. And again. Now pick up some leaves from the trees. Time to flap our elephant ears. Back to 
are enormous elephant steps. Sway, sway, and then take a bow. Oh, I love dancing. Maybe one day I'll become a ballerina. And a fine ballerina you would make, Cammy. Now, can you remember everything that we did today? Of course. We met those enormous elephants. And we had lots of fun waltzing. And what about the big double bass that played the waltz? Oh yes, of course! Just like the elephant is the largest animal in the land, the double bass is the biggest instrument in the orchestra. Here you are, home sweet home. Now, remember your trunk. One, two, three, one, two, three. Not that trunk, silly. Your big suitcase. Oh, <laughs> of course, Captain Cuthbert. Thank you for reminding me. An elephant wouldn't forget their trunk, would they? Not with those great memories. <laughs> Goodbye, Captain Cuthbert. Toodle pup adventurers. Good night, Cammy. And we'll see you all next time for our next animal-tastic, musicalistic adventure. Farewell, fellow travellers. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>